Well, we could rename these teams David and Goliath, but David did beat Goliath. I wonder whether we're going to get that sort of upset today, Alan. Well, they've got nothing to lose. I mean, it's their attitude that will count. Are they going to just put 11 men behind the ball, or are they going to have a go? Antonio Rudiger. Main game today, Germany against Ivory Coast. We talk about the highest level that a player can achieve, Alan. You had the honour of playing for England, and we've got two national teams here today. Oh, it's always a special moment. You pull on your nation's shirt. Always a big game. This is no different. Germany are going to go for this lineup for this match. One thing to look out for from this team today is the way they try and win the ball back within seconds of losing it. Yeah, and they don't do it individually, they get backed up by a teammate, they hunt in packs, and you've got to do that, you've got to do it with discipline. I suppose this represents the third stage for Arsenal Football Club, really, Alan. Uh, they started in South London and moved to Highbury, where, of course, the majority of the history for the home games have been played there. And now this move to a state-of-the-art stadium and a big revenue stream brings in a huge amount of money here. It does, and it's interesting as well this season, the fact that Tottenham have got their shiny new stadium just across North London. I think there's... Uh, a little bit of pressure on the Arsenal fans, maybe, to make sure that the atmosphere is a really good one for these home matches. It's what we've been waiting for. The kick-off, the game is underway. Bit of space to go forward into with the ball. Couldn't hold on to the ball. Javinho. Kroos. Goretzka. Marco Royce. Tony Kroos. Well, here comes the support. Joshua Kimmich. A lot of defenders between them and the goal, but they still got the ball. Well, that's relieved some of the pressure as the defender clears his lines out of play. Marco Reus. Nabry. Tony Kroos is a, a midfield player who likes to control the tempo of a match. He's not a great goal scorer. But he did get two, of course, for Germany in that extraordinary 7-1 win in the World Cup against the host Brazil. Yeah, and the, the opposition will want to get close to him today because if he's allowed to pass it left and right, it's that metronomic rhythm of his and he really gets his team on the front foot. Just read the intentions of the opposition there to make the interception. Only a semblance of an opportunity, really, but he's turned it into a great goal with the first-time strike. I don't think he had a chance, you know, to take a, another touch. He would have been crowded out, so what a decision. Looking good for Germany, they now lead.
Joshua Kimmich. Ferezka. It's Kimmich. Tony Kroos. Serge Gnabry. He's got his shot off now. Oh, it's the post. Safety first there. Well, if that one had gone in, it would have put a much different complexion on this match. As it is, it's still game on. Well, that'll be a throw. Aurier. Traore. Seal. Javinho. The shot's on. Well, they're doing their marking properly at the corner here. It looks like it anyway. Those fans sensing a chance here. They've got to capitalise on these kind of set pieces on what is really a much superior team. Corner played into the middle, and they get it away. Oh, time to get the cross now. It's a weak cross, really, not getting past the first defender. And now the shot! They pulled it back level with this goal. That has just lasered into the corner. Unstoppable. Well, here's the goal again. It is uh, level. Both sides have scored here now. Ginter. Marco Royce. Joshua Kimmich. This could lead to a chance. It's good attacking play. Looking for an opening with some good control build up. Tony Cross. It's Kimmich. Zula. Joshua Kimmich, Royce, Kroos, Royce, and they're keeping the ball, that's the important thing. Here's the chance to get in the cross. Goretzka, Joshua Kimmich, Tony Kroos, and they've got it away from the danger. Aurier. That's a good way to nick the ball back. Quick thinking. He can lay it off to the supporting player. Sane. Very straightforward piece of goalkeeping as he catches the cross. Striding forward purposefully. Max Gradel. Aurier. Looking to use the full width of the pitch in this attack. On the move and able to cut out the pass. Marco Royce. And there's the room for Royce. Opportunity to cross it now. Max Gradel. Maybe took his eye off the ball. Koreska. It's Kimmich. Now Gnabry. Leroy Sane. really get at the opposition here 
Maybe he'll cross it here. Put in from the wide area. Defended well. Brandt. Goretzka. Goretzka. And here's the shot. The shot gets blocked. And the ball knocked away long. They got plenty of distance into the clearance, but actually it's going to come back at them again. Two minutes. Two minutes left. That's added time. Still got a bit to do, but this is promising. Trying to pick out someone in the centre. It's not really away. Poor clearance. Royce. He's taking the attack to the Marco Royce. Not really away from the threat here. So we're halfway through what has been uh, an interesting match, certainly intriguing, this international friendly. I think that's a good performance, isn't it, Alan, from him in the first half? Well, he stepped forward for his team there with that equaliser, but his team haven't been, what you would say, on the best of form. Second half coming up at the Emirates. Close to goalkeeper, actually did get a touch on it, but I think it was a pretty good effort to do that much. Well beaten, really. Yeah, I don't think you can blame the keeper, Martin. He's looking at his defenders. Why was the lad given so much space? Germany, then, are trailing here. Matthias Ginte. Sane. An opponent around him, that's good screening of the football. They've got numbers in this attack, and it looks dangerous. And that will be a goal kick. Alan, what's gone wrong with him? He looks off the pace. Well, he won't be happy to see this kind of graphic. He's probably aware of how shot-shy he's been. He's got to step it up, he really has. I mean, his team are losing. Tony Kroos. Kroos. That's a combination of skill and will to hold off the opposition. Marco Reus. Goretzka. Building steadily here, keeping possession. Here's a chance to whip it in. Got the opposition backpedalling a little bit. Sane! They've responded well with the equaliser. Oh, it's ding dong out there. Superb goal here. Well, he's got a track record of that. On his left side, he's so dangerous. Well, they want to see this again, this goal. Well, you can't blame him, the manager is delighted with the character his team has shown to get back into this game. Brilliant entertainment, the scores are level again, very tight affair here. Number 19, Javinho. Leroy Sane. Javinho. Aurier, going forward well. Javinho. It's a perfect day for the player. They will be signing the match ball for him afterwards because of a hat-trick. Yeah, he won't forget this day in a hurry. Top stuff from him.
Germany then are trailing here. Marco Royce. Now Gnabry. In control, it's Tony Kroos. Always knows what he's going to do with the ball before he receives it. Serge Gnabry. That certainly helps the goalkeeper and those in the middle to stop the cross like that. Max Gradle. Well, here comes a substitution now. It goes out wide again. And it's gone behind for a goal kick. Well, no surprise at this stage in the game that the managers are thinking about making changes. In fact, both managers are here, and we will get a substitution apiece. Matthias Ginte. Here's Antonio Rudiger. Royce. Sane. Gunduan. Brandt, Tony Kroos, here's Sané, Brandt, oh, time to get the cross now, that's rather skewed off his head in the end, yeah, he, uh, he didn't catch it properly, I think he probably closed his eyes there, well, Mr Smith's eyes lit up alongside me and he's only on the gantry, he'd love to have taken that chance, he would have taken that chance, well, I think he will, the manager will be at him for that, because it was, a, it was an easy header, Time for a substitution. A lot of defenders between them and the goal, but they still got the ball. Good defensive clearance there. 20 minutes of the 90 still to play. Marco Royce. Good to add. Well, he was in the right place at the right time to cut it out. Max Gradle. Well, here comes the support. Traore. The shot's on! The chance did open up for that kind of shot. Uh, if you don't have a go. Yeah, the referee's signalling for the substitution to take place now. And he's going to go off, and he's going to go off to a huge ovation. Yeah, and look at him, he's lapping it up, and why wouldn't he? He's putting an awful lot of effort here, quality. Julian Draxler, time ticking on, just over 15 minutes to go. Well, the team with the ball have got a problem now, because the opposition are just sitting behind the ball and letting them pass in front. They've got to find some attacking shots on here. And they've blocked it then. Oh, it's a corner by that deflection. Corner. I think the uh, manager's decided he wants to let the player have a great individual reception, which he wouldn't get at the final whistle. He's uh, getting an ovation now as the substitution is made. Yeah, and well-deserved too. A strong contender for man of the match. Corner from Tony Kroos. And they get it away. In towards Gundogan. Did well, stuck out a foot and cut off the pass. Julian Draxler. Sane. That's a combination of skill and will to hold off the opposition. Gundogan! And there it is, late on, but it is the equaliser. That was a goal of deluxe class. 
It's come in from a long way out, and from that angle, it's not always easy to finish. Defenders caught out by it in the end. A good look here, again, by the replay of the goal. We well, can't blame him. The manager is delighted with the character his team has shown to get back into this game. Well, it's level again in the match. What a roller coaster ride it's been. See you. This would be the time to score, wouldn't it? Because I think it would be the winning goal. Eric Bailly. Max Gradle. Javinho. Can find some space here on the flanks. Defended well. Max Gradle. Sane. We're very late in the game now. And the scores are still level. Germany still trying to get the extra goal. Oh, that's good defending. Four minutes. Four minutes of added time to come. See you. Traore. Cleverly done. And there was danger, but he's cleared it. Traore. Chance for the cross. Julian Draxler. Well, here's an opportunity with the ball over the top. Well, most of these supporters came in expecting to see that. That's the end of regulation time with the scores level. Here's a chance to whip it in. Got the opposition backpedalling a little bit. Sane! Well, they've responded well with the equaliser. Oh, it's ding-dong out there. Superb goal here. Well, he's got a... Javinho. A score! Super goal! Patrick, goal number three here, and it's a perfect day for the player. It's a combination of skill and will to hold off the opposition. Gundogan, and there it is, late on, but it is the equaliser. <laughs> 